The United States government has suspended financial assistance to Gabon after a military coup earlier this year ousted President Ali Bongo. Washington, which had already halted part of its foreign aid at the end of September, formally declared that a coup d'etat had taken place in Gabon, which under Section 7008 of the Department of State's Annual Appropriations Act implies the end of all humanitarian aid. In a statement made by the State Department spokesman, Matthew Miller, the U.S. will resume assistance at the same time as concrete actions are taken by the transition government to establish a democratic regime. Gabon, an oil-rich country, received little U.S. aid, unlike other countries such as Niger, which also experienced a coup d'etat at the end of July. On August 30th, the Gabonese army overthrew President Ali Bongo, who had been in power for 14 years, in a coup d'etat denounced by the international community. Gabon's new military appointed Prime Minister, Raymond Dongsima, has called for a distinction to be drawn between coup d'etat and coup d'etat.